We dance, we sang, and now it's a story time. The story is from the Jataka storybook, which was written about 800 years ago. It has 547 different stories of the past lives of Lord Buddha. And stories from this book has inspired numerous works of art in Sri Lanka. So the story I'm going to tell you today is the Sandakinduru Jara. Sandakinduru is an imaginary creature found in literature. The closest resemblance we can find is the mermaid, but Sandakinduru does not live in water. So there was this Sandakinduru couple in the forest, the mermaid couple. They were in love with, love with each other and they were having a good time when the king was on a hunting trip in the forest. And the king saw the female mermaid and thought if he killed the male mermaid, he could win over the female mermaid. So he shot, he shot an arrow to the male mermaid, killed him and tried to win over the female mermaid, Sandakinduri. But she never fell to his uh, trap. She was weeping and cursing the king. And the Almighty Shakra heard her weeping and came to the earth from the heavens and gave back life to the male mermaid and they lived happily ever after. The, the next dance is for a song inspired by this story. In this song, it is depicted how the female mermaid was in despair while her lover was dead. This dance will be performed by Kumari Ranasinghe, a talented dancer in Manitoba who has graduated from the prestigious university of University of Kalania in Sri Lanka. Please welcome Hinduriya Kage Milakha. 